a home is something that we always want to come back to no matter which luxurious hotel we stay in the comfort of home cooked meal and the cozy bed and blanket of our bedroom are the most craved ones probably that's why a wise man once quoted home is what you take with you and not what you leave behind hello everyone namaste and welcome back my name is shweta and i upload videos here on every monday and thursday on homemaking cooking organizing and many more if you are interested in such topics then do subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for future notifications last 15 to 20 days of my life were truly chaotic As you have seen in my vlogs I was busy with festivals travels functions and what not obviously as I was preoccupied with all these I couldn't give enough time to my house apart from the basic attention I left my home as it was for the past few days and every corner of my house is craving for my attention literally screaming so i took up the task to reset my house today so that i can have a peaceful mind and save my sanity Yes dears giving time to your house is also as important as giving time to our family this is where we cherish all the memories of our family so keeping it in a good state is our responsibility i completely neglected changing the sofa covers and bed sheets for these few days as i felt they were unimportant during those days but now it's high time i change them and so after my usual tea and breakfast which was poha by the way i got all the necessary things from my linen closet and got myself geared up for the day I usually change the sofa covers and cushion covers in every 15 days but it's been over a month now <laughs> guilty me but better late than never I have multiple sofa covers with me three of which are actually sofa covers and the rest are either old bed sheets torn into half or plain shawls like this one I cut this shawl into two and I am using them as sofa covers. This shawl was otherwise just lying in the cupboard. Hardly we use these. I use them as a throw for few days but now it's serving as a sofa cover. <laughs> Why waste, right? This is me. I reuse and upcycle a lot of things like this. I'm also changing the carpet according to the theme. Here I'm following beige and brown theme along with yellow pop-up color. As I mentioned before too, I change the colors according to the weather. As the weather is gloomy and cloudy, I'm adding pastel colors with pop-ups to brighten up my living room. So after setting this up I added the cushion covers to bring some colors always light colors bring elegance to the place and here my husband was hesitant as i was recording and he was asking if he could come in i felt as if i was a teacher you know yes you may come in to brighten up this light colors i'm adding two brown fur cushions here My ZZ plant doesn't seem to be happy here because of the lack of sunlight I guess the leaves are turning yellow so I decided to change it with this artificial flower pot which I purchased from Vishal Mart This when placed here is not only serving the purpose of a decor but also adding a pop of color to this entire look am I right This cozy little corner was looking amazing when I lighted up the candle in the night. My money plant also needed some sunlight so for few days I am replacing it with my syngonium here. I just add rice water to all my indoor plants whenever the soil is dry and they seem to be very happy with this practice. Touch wood. Following the theme 
I added a brown pot here and this is the entire look. Both my money plant and ZZ plant are going here to enjoy their sunbath for few days. Now coming to the dining area. Somehow after removing the lazy Susan from here, I felt my dining table look has become very dull and unappealing. So, I thought of adding some elements to this area to bring out its beauty. As usual, first I am cleaning out the whole table to start with a clean canvas. I have two to three table runners with me and I took out this one to match with the living room theme. Adding a runner to this plain table brings in a nice change. I recently went to Market 99 and I was amazed to see that many things were on sale that day and I grabbed a few items. One among those is this beautiful wire tray. I know it looks like a rotten tray but it's a wire tray and it costed me just 100 bucks. The moment I saw it, I knew what I am buying it for, the dining area. So here I am placing it to serve its purpose. This glass bowl was just for 150. I fell in love with it instantly. It's beautiful as a decor. I put some Imli candies in this and this has become the showstopper for this place. Isn't it? I am loving the entire look. This carpet area was also neglected for a very long time, including the plants here. So, first I am replacing the carpet here. This long carpet is not a carpet actually, it's a table runner but I am using it to serve the purpose of a carpet here. This money plant was growing all over the place. All the climbers were coming down and so I am adjusting the climbers here. It needed some love so that it can thrive again. So this is how I showed my love towards it. So this is the reverb look of my dining area, a peaceful place for me. Now comes the bedroom. <laughs> Though I changed my bed sheets without fail every week, I couldn't change the duvet cover for two weeks in a row. I used to wash the duvet cover every week and put the same one on again as I had only two of these and I didn't want to open the new ones soon. But now, I felt I needed a change in my room, so I got the new set of IKEA bed sheet and duvet covers which I am changing now. I am going to link the IKEA haul video in the iCard, do check. As I mentioned before too, this room has very minimal ventilation so I prefer light colors and this beige color is looking amazing. The IKEA bed sheets did not come with pillow covers so to bring in a pop of color to this entire look, I added the maroon pillow covers that I had and that brought a huge change. After practicing for 2 to 3 times, I became comfortable with putting on the duvet cover. Now it takes only 5 to 10 minutes for me. <laughs> I'm sure I'll master it soon. And this is my bedroom look after the change. You know, sometimes I feel it's okay to leave things around in a mess. What matters is to reset it after that. This reset is important as it resets the mind too. Somehow until I did all this, I was restless. Though I sat to rest or went to sleep, I felt as if I was not okay. I was missing something and once I finished resetting the house, I fell asleep the moment I hit the bed. I know maybe it's just me or the OCD in me but a clean place gives me high. So pause, rest, reset and rise. This is the best mantra for a peaceful life. 
and yes here's my piece gone my favorite work along with the house reset i had to reset my laundry too it's been 4 days and i haven't done the laundry and so here i am dragging myself to do this if you are also on a break then get up and finish off the works you have been contemplating to do come on get up see you all soon with a new video until then take care keep smiling bye bye